There's even a, a zone called Gimmick Mountain Zone as well, which throws a whole load of stuff at you. And this is the notorious Sky High Zone, by the way. Um, I will say I do kind of like it a little bit, but the level feels very uneven, and I think a lot of people were turned off. I think this is the point where I probably turned off the game, because I'm like, what the hell's going on? This isn't Sonic. This isn't what I'm used to, you know? So it was only until a few years ago when I picked up this game again I started to like it because um, as a kid you can't kind of see like when the game's trying to help you out and I didn't quite realise that the game actually gives you, you know, the item boxes respawn when you lose a life so in theory I could collect two lives on a stage, die and then redo the stage again and collect, collect the stuff again and just keep collecting extra lives which would help me practice the game so as a kid that didn't really factor into my mind at all. There we go, we'll zoom over here now. Because we're going to go use the hang glider. Bear with me just a second. Right, there we go. Sorry about that. Right, pick up the um, invincibility. There we go. Right, we're going to do that, and just slowly take Sonic, using the hang glider. You don't want to tap too many times, so just tap once or twice on the back, and this will take you to the end. So that's the first act done. The second act is notoriously difficult, I think. Um, I'm not trying to get the Chaos Emerald now, but um, whenever I have got it, it makes getting to the end really easy, so I might try and get it. I don't know. See how it goes. I just kind of want to get through this act if I can. Reliable, so it's almost like luck when I'm able to get anything out of it before. So I'm just taking a few taps now, and look, the wind's sort of taking me up. But you see, that enemy's always in my way, so I can't always get to the baddies, or get through them, or get past them. Here we go, it's taking me up now anyway. There we are. I will try my best anyway to get through. Right now, there's a hang glider there, so if I can just use this. There we are. This will get me to the end. There we are. Do you know, I might be able to do this, guys, actually. Let's get on these things. I've never actually done the level like this, by the way. So this is a rarity for me. And there you go. Okay. Wasn't too difficult then. In fact, it was even easier, <laughs> to be honest. There we go. I wanted to get through that because it's horrible. It's really horrible act. Particularly if you're new to it and stuff. I mean, I could have picked up the extra lives, but to be honest, I don't really think I need them. Um, I will be picking up some excess lives later on anyway. Right, we're on Act 3 now, and it's another boss already. And we have to fight this giant mechanical bird. So let's do this. But first, we have to fight his children. Yeah, I know, right? This is really awkward. <sighs> there we are. As soon as you fall down, roll and quickly destroy. And if you're quick enough, you can actually get rid of three of them before he even knows what's happening. Wait till he fires before you bounce off his bonds. Let him do that first because you'll ricochet into the fire if you try and hit him straight away. So you need to give the fire like a second or two and there you go and he's dead. And that's how you do it. There you go guys, that's like two zones in about ten minutes. So that's how quick this game is, you know. Pretty good. I'm just so glad I don't need to worry about collecting those Chaos Emeralds.